Well, in case you were thinking the sportsman show circuit is all done here in Alberta, think again. It was, I was actually walking my way out of the show uh, uh, the other day when it was up here in Edmonton and got stopped by one of the organizers and they said, hey, we just are going to be putting a show together in Lethbridge. So I reached out to Wes David from um, Fishing the West TV show. And uh, of course, Wes is a, a staple at the sportsman shows up on the uh, stage, uh, the wild TV stage, uh, imparting his wisdom when it comes to all things angling. Wes, uh, thanks so much for taking some time and chatting with us today. Oh, no, thank you for having me on the show, Mike. So uh, talk to us a little bit about Lethbridge. It's kind of an expansion, uh, something new for the Sportsman Show folks. Uh, it's great to see that some of the larger centers in, in other parts of the province are, are getting some attention. Yeah, it, it's, it's been in the works behind the scenes for quite some time now. Uh, Lethbridge being the third largest city in Alberta. And... Uh, we, we've heard rumors it's been anywhere from five years to 20 years since they've had a show. And we did some promotional work down there in February. And everybody, the hype is the hype is big. They're excited to have their own show. As you know, Southern Alberta is full of hunting and fishing and camping and everything outdoors. So everybody's really excited about the show coming up here April 5th through 7th. You know, education does play an important role. It's, it's. I mean, as wonderful as it is for folks to wander through and, and look at all the new technology and all the new products when it comes to our, our outdoor passions, education, being able to sit and, and talk with folks like yourself, it plays such an important role in, in these programs, doesn't it? Absolutely, 100%. Um, I mean, I, I wouldn't have been, I wouldn't be in this position if I didn't have, you know, the young age people to ask and talk about and point me in the right direction. Um, and, and I truly believe, you know, conservation wise, the best conservation minded people out there, are hunters, anglers, farmers, and ranchers, and everyone's willing to share and help. Our goal with Fish in the Wild West TV is just to help people catch one more fish. And I imagine on that line of conservation groups like the Alberta Hunter Education Instructors Association will be on hand, uh, uh, Fish and Game, um, and and others. Uh, can you give us also a sense of other folks that might be um, working the stage with you? Yeah, and you're right on the conservation. Um, Lethbridge Fish and Game will be there. Uh, he is there 60 years. Uh, he has been, and they're going to be at the show. On the stage, we have Jeremy Evans, which is the author of, of Mauled and the Survivor of Being Mauled by a Grizzly Bear in Western Alberta. Um, his story is a true story of, of survival and, you know, and, and the will to live. Um, we have uh, Jessica with Jessica Wild. She's talking about basically from field to table and what to do with your, your game, not only the meat but you, the thing different things you can do with the hides and and stuff from your game using it all um we got dirt nap tv talking elk hunting we got some fly fishing josh nugent to be there with his own casting pond so it's there's something for everyone at, at lethbridge and all the shows uh, i'll be there talking uh reservoir walleye which is my favorite topic walleye fishing and uh, even even the Fish and Wild West TV boat, the tractor boat, will be part of the stage. So if you want to know how I rig it, rig a boat, or maybe you want some new ideas how to rig your boat, I'm uh, I'm welcome to show anybody they want to see. They can sit in my boat, do whatever they want, and and see how I rig it, and we can talk everything fishing. Well, it sounds like a, just a, a, a really cool few days. Um, again, that's April the 5th through the 7th. And, okay, I'll tackle the name, uh, Wes. I'll let you off the hook. Agri-Food Hub and Trade Center in Lethbridge is the place to do it. Uh, Wes, uh, we wish you nothing but success at the show. And uh, thanks so much for spending a little bit of time chatting with us today. Oh, thank you for having me on the show. Uh, it's a great pleasure. I hope to see everybody at the Southern Alberta Outdoor Show.